Where we start with breaking news tonight as crews continue their search for a tractor trailer in the waters near the Chesapeake Bay Bridge Tunnel. I'm Tom Shad. And I'm Anita Blanton. The first calls came in around 645 this evening about the time of storms moving through that area. This picture sent to us by a witness at the scene. You can see that van crumpled, a section of the important guardrail gone. Investigators are working to learn if this crash pushed the tractor trailer into the water. The scene southbound near the high rise bridge near Fisherman Island, mile marker 12. Penny, your size, Deanna Bedaneshi, joins us from the eastern shore near the entrance of the bridge. So, Deanna, what are you learning? Well, we know that this crash had all of the southbound lanes here at this entrance of the tunnel on the southbound side here closed for more than an hour, but you can see it is back open and cars are able to drive smoothly on that side. Now, police say the crash happened on the west side of the southbound span between the North Channel Bridge and the northernmost island. A van and tractor trailer collided and police believe the tractor trailer went off of the bridge into the water. Crews were out looking for that tractor trailer by boat and helicopter. Police say the van involved had five people in it. They were treated and released on scene. They say there is heavy guardrail and curb damage to that area, and maintenance crews are making emergency repairs tonight. Now, just around 10 o'clock, we did learn that divers will be going out into the water as long as there is no lightning. And as soon as we do have any more updates for you, we'll pass that along to you on wavy.com. Reporting live on the Eastern Shore, Deanna Betaneshi, 10 on your side.